Good morning, everybody. Today is a very exciting day. Do you want to know why it's an exciting day? I have decided to take matters into my own hands. Um, as you've probably seen, I had purple hair like a couple weeks ago, and it was really fun, and I really loved it, and then it faded in like two seconds. So I didn't really want to go like get it redone, so I just decided like, why shouldn't I just dye my hair purple by myself? Now I know the look you're probably giving me right now because literally everyone I've mentioned this to has been like, uh, probably don't do that. But I have high hopes for this and I think it's going to turn out really well. And I have watched like at least two whole YouTube videos. So I'm kind of an expert now of like how to do it. Worst thing that can happen is I like mess it up and it's not even and then I just have to dye my whole head purple. And honestly, that wouldn't be the worst thing that ever happened. That would actually be pretty great. But um, we're going to stick with like the purple ombre vibes today. So we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to take a little trip down to um, whatever that like hair place is. And I'm going to go see. Maybe they can give me some pointers. If not, then I'm just going to buy whatever I find and pray that it turns out well. So I thought it would be fun to vlog the whole experience because first of all, I just like vlogging. But also, you know... It could be a train wreck, and if it is a train wreck, that makes for way better quality entertainment than anything else would. So, not that I'm hoping for a train wreck, but just in case. What the? A car just pulled up in front of my house. They just turned off their car. Uh... <laughs> Why is this person at my house? What the heck? Should I talk to them? Hi! How are you? I'm fine. Um, she is at work today. Thank you! Okay, so that was all about this guy. So, you may have seen on my story the other day, a tree fell on our house. It wasn't too bad. I kind of was too dramatic about it and people were like, oh my gosh, a tree fell on your house. Are you okay? Like, yeah, everything was fine. But a tree fell on our house and um, this guy is coming to fix it and apparently when he came to fix it, he accidentally like rammed a like limb through our like, um, that we have like a floor room that's kind of like all glass walls or whatever that I was up against. And so one of the... Um, branches went through the thing so it broke or whatever but anyways he's coming back to like try and fix it or something I don't know but um that was funny anyways let's go get some hair dye Woo! All right, so I just got the color. I got, wait, let's see. I spent like 8,000 years picking out what color I wanted, but I decided on the Manic Panic um, Ultraviolet. So I feel like this is fun, and I feel like this is close to the color mine was when I first got it done, and I wanted to do it dark because I know it's gonna fade in five seconds, and this one's actually semi-permanent, and the other one I did was permanent. So I feel like it's gonna fade faster. Is that how that works? I don't know. I don't know anything about this. But when I told the girl, she was like, do you need help? And I was like, um, kind of, yes. I was like, I'm going to dye my hair purple. I've never dyed it by myself purple. I had someone else dye it purple. And she looked at me like I was a lunatic. And I was like, great. This is a good sign <laughs> for how things are going. I also got, though, because in the YouTube video I watched, um, a girl was using these. And I was like, oh, maybe I should get this. And there's like this thing that like... I don't know. It's like purple shampoo and like apparently it like makes you not have yellow hair and it makes it more like not like brassy but like something else. So anyways, I don't know if I'm using that too. But I only spent twenty dollars in all. So if this goes as planned, I will forever be doing my own hair. Well, other than the blonde. I don't trust myself to like do the blonde. But the purple, I will forever be doing by myself if this goes as planned because $20 for like the shampoo and I got conditioner and I also got the color. That's a lot cheaper than what I spent on the other thing. Why is it raining? 
Okay, well next, there's a TJ Maxx over here, so I'm gonna take a little detour and go to TJ Maxx because I can't drive past the TJ Maxx and not go inside. So, anyways, I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna go home and dye my hair, yay! Let's go out in New York, that's what I won't think of you in love. Shout out to me for only buying dry shampoo at TJ Maxx. I'm pretty proud of myself that didn't turn into a big production. Um, now let's go dye some hair. Okay, we gotta make one more stop. I'm starving. I feel like this is gonna be a long process, so I need to get food and be prepared for this. So I'm at Sam's, and I don't know how to say that second word. Everyone tells me to say it different ways, so I just refuse to say it at all. But this place is like literally the bomb com so I'm excited about it and it's so much food and I'm so happy right now so I'm gonna go get some I know okay I don't know what that music is I know this vlog is um, supposed to have a topic and that topic is hair and not food but I just need y'all to see how amazing this food is prepare yourselves because you're all about to get so hungry right now Look at this. this it's amazing it is literally amazing so happy right now. I love food with my whole heart. Anyways, just a little uh, lunch appreciation. Now we can get back to the hair stuff. This could be really bad. This could be really bad, but it also could be really good. So, you know, we're taking chances, living on the edge, doing fun things. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be totally fine. Where's my hair dye? Okay, shampoo hair. Already shampooed my hair, so that's fine. Empty desired amount into coloring bowl. Apply evenly with tint brush. Okay, well I don't have a coloring bowl and I don't have a tint brush, so we're gonna <laughs> make do with what we have. Hmm. What can I use for a tint brush? I feel like these are those brushes that are like kind of rubbery. I mean, can I just use my like hands though? I feel like the girl in the video just used her hands and I have gloves. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. I probably should have invested in one of those like capey things, but I didn't. So that's fine. I'm just gonna do this and um, pray to Jesus that it doesn't end badly. Yeah, I feel like I don't need a tint brush. <laughs> I feel like I'm just <laughs> gonna do my own thing. It's totally fine. Everything's fine. Okay, don't freak out. Now, I don't know anything about this. I don't know if I'm supposed to stir this. I really probably should have consulted somebody or maybe watched more than the one YouTube video that I watched. I can't even get the thing open. If I make it through this without having stains of purple all over me, then I will count it as a success. City and state, cause everywhere I find this It also says to test like one part of your hair, but I don't really want to do that. I just want to like do it all. <laughs> so I'm not doing that. Oh my gosh, it's so purple. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Is this a bad idea? <laughs> okay, I'm just doing it. I'm literally just gonna do it. No going back now. sections right I should have done more research on this before I just started dyeing my hair dark purple okay when I saw the girl do it she kind of did this little number like where she kind of just like I'm just gonna do that and I feel like that's a good idea see here's the other issue it's gonna get so much on the other I have to be very careful about this I feel like I want them all different lengths, right? Like I don't want just like straight across, right? Is that what I want? I don't even know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what am I doing? I am dyeing my hair purple. Who am I? Like, who told me that like I could do this by myself? Nobody, actually. Everyone actually told me not to do it by myself. When people tell me that I can't do something, it kind of makes me really just want to like do it. So that's probably how I got myself into this situation that I'm currently in. So really, I can't be held accountable because y'all are all the ones who looked at me like I was crazy. 
that's going to be the issue to avoid is touching the purple to another purple area i mean worst comes to worst just do my whole head purple like i really don't see a dilemma in that can we talk about how unhelpful the girl was at Sally's today? Went to Sally's to get this dye. And I was like, she's like, do you need help? And I was like, yes, I actually do need help. I would love your input on this. I want to do my hair purple. And then she was like, okay, well, these are all our dyes. And I was like, okay, like, I really want like a, like, lavendery purple. And she was like, yeah, purple means a lot of different things to a lot of different people. So, and I was like, okay. Thank you for your assistance, woman. I appreciate you, but you weren't really all that great about. <laughs> what if this is not even? Do you think it's gonna be even? You'll be back again. Now oh, I'm a hot babe. Ah, you will always be a part of me. Boy, don't you know you can't escape me? Oh, shoot. Oh, whew. Close call. I just grabbed the top of my hair with these gloves. I know that I, you'll be right back for me. Something like that. Days and your nights get a little bit colder. Okay, I don't know how I think I'm gonna get to this other hair. When I got my hair dyed purple from the other people, like the real people, they have like three people doing this all at once. And now it's just like casually me by myself doing my own hair where I can't like really actually reach any part of anything. Yeah, who needs a tint brush? What even is a tint brush? We don't need that here. Things are going just fine without a tint brush. Who needs a bowl? Not me. Ain't nobody got time for bowls. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. I'm a mess, that's okay, style my hair, bright purple, hoping it fades kind of quickly because this is a lot darker than I really wanted. Okay, this did not take nearly as long as like I really thought it was going to. Um, I'm actually just super hyped about this though because I actually really like this purple. Not really the color I had initially envisioned. But I think this will be fun. Um, I'm just gonna wait 30 minutes. It says leave it on for 30 minutes, so that's what I'm doing right now. And I'm gonna try and be very still so that the purple does not end up on other parts of my head or body. And then we will come back and see. All right, so I just let it sit for 30 minutes, and now I'm going to wash it out like the directions say. And this is basically the last step. So um, I would film myself washing it out, but I feel like I need to really focus on washing it out and not getting it all over the rest of my head. So um, you're just going to have to sit here while I stick my head in this sink and figure this out. Okay, bye. <laughs> it's done! O-M-G. I cannot believe that I just dyed my own hair purple. My only regret is maybe not going higher on it, like doing it up a little further. Um, but I think it actually turned out well. I mean, obviously it's probably not perfect because like, I don't know how to do hair, but I mean, it's fun. It's what I wanted. It's, um, I'm excited to have purple hair again. I missed my purple hair. You are all welcome now to start making appointments at Megan Golden's Purple Ombre Hair Salon. Um, that's the only thing I know how to do, but I will definitely give you a purple ombre if you want me to give you a purple ombre. Obviously, I'm an expert at it. I've done one whole ombre before in my life, so um, I clearly know what I'm doing. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Y'all have a great day. See you next time. Bye. I'll be over you.